Hey everybody! Welcome back to Opercat playing Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets for GameCube. So I'm in the Gryffindor common room now. Uh, Run wants me to go see Fred and George before I can go to bed. The dick. Anyway, so uh, let's see what he has. Um, let's see what they have in, s in store. What can I buy? Um, I don't like the music here. Um, where is he? Do I want a wall sneak? Oh, I can't see. I can't see anything. I think I see- Oh god! Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! I didn't know he was right there. Holy crap! Oh god! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, don't wall sneak in that room. It makes your visibility worse. Ah, Potter! You finally made it then. I heard about the Ford Anglia. Mom's gonna kill Ron when she finds out. I bet it was worth it to see Snape's face when you landed. Sort of. Anyway, welcome to our shop, Harry. Yes. Feel free to browse our extensive range of wizard weezers and magical merchandise. Everything priced at reasonable rates and the only currency universally accepted throughout Hogwarts. Bertie bots every flavor beans. We're sure there's something here you'll like. Okay. I really have to sneeze. <coughs> Sorry about that. Bless me. Hey, Fred, what's up? Is there anything here that interests you? Oh, it's gonna look around. Oh, there's a glowing book. That's interesting. Is that a spell book? How much is an Alahamora spell book? One hundred Bertie bots every flavor beans. I can't even carry that many. That, what a ripoff. Ooh, special. Uh. Albert Grunion, the inventor of the dung bomb. How much is that? Thirty Bertie bots every flavor beans. That's thirty for around, a, a wizard card. How much is this Wiganwell potion vial? One hundred Bertie bots every flavor beans. Still can't afford that either. Uh, what the hell are these things? Balloons? No explodable luminous balloons! What do they cost? 20 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. So 30 and 20, so I could buy a wizard card and these, but I want to look around still. How much is this stink pellet bag? 20 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. 20. How much is this egg a stronger card? 30 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. So it looks like so far are a great way to stop prefects catching you shut up red or george bots bean bag? 20 Bertie bots every flavor beans oh only 20 for that uh i'd like to buy that please sure you can now carry more Bertie bots every flavor beans harry you collected a birdie bots what oh now i can carry 50 more beans that's cool okay and i still have enough money to buy a wizard card if i want how much is a pack of stink pellets? 20 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. Okay. A balloon holster. What does this cost? 20 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. 20. The Archibald Alderton card. How much is that? 30 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. I'm just gonna assume that all of the wizard cards cost 30. Probably just go with the first one I saw. Albert Grunion, the inventor of the Dung Bomb. How much is that? 30, 30 bots I probably should have just popped the last one I I, I talked to about. Ah, Elberic Grunion. Where would we be without his outstanding contribution to explosive dung? That is a good question. Number 97. Elberic Grunion. Inventor of the dung bomb. Okay. Oh, is that, like, stuff spelt all over his chest? Whoopsie. Do you need a bib, sir? Anyway, um, can't really buy anything else. So, pretty much, uh, it seems like these two things cost a hundred, but everything else, um, well, the wizard cards all, all cost thirty, it seems like. So what else is around here? A great way to distract prefects and annoy Percy. I can't go through this door? That's unfortunate. I can't open the stupid things. Okay, fine. Ah, why am I getting lag? I don't like that. Oh, this is bathroom. You said I've been a bathroom. What's wrong with you guys? Well, I mean, like, you get a lot of good business. <laughs> Whatever works for you, man. Shoot all the toilets. Uh, wh oh, trying to shoot the things right there. Doesn't make a difference. 
Oh, there's no toilet in here. Those bricks lie are lighting up very suspiciously. Oh, oh, okay. Where's this gonna lead me? Can't shoot anything else. Just trying to figure out where this is weird. Crawl into. Oh, oh. Oh, Percy's right there. Oh, okay. I just kind of made a loop around. Okay. Let's get out of here. I don't want to run into Percy. That would, n that would not be fun for anybody, would it? Who the hell is this guy? He looks just like Harry, but without the glasses. I guess that's like Dumbledore's dad or something. I don't know. This painting is askew. You need to fix it and get it more level. Yeah, so... In a potion file case. I guess the next time we're in the, the greenhouses we'll have to look around for it. Well, I'll probably do a whole bunch of those later. Can I read the book? No? Can't read that book? That's- that's- that's cool. I'm just gonna stand in front of the fire. Can't do that either? Alright, fine. Suck to run. Okay, Harry. It's been a long day. Really tired and I'm off to bed. Okay. So, zero beans, but I can collect a hundred now. Uh, zero house points, fifteen dung bombs. Potion vial. Uh, here's a map of the place. Rivendor common room. That's where I am now. Okay then. That's where I am now. So I can choose to end the day here. But I, so I want to see if I can uh, go to my bed and end it that way as well. Is Ron actually in bed? No. Where did he go? Did he disappear? Are you under the sheets? I don't know, man. Yeah, so I, get, I can also just go to my bed and end the day that way as well, so that's good to know. Can't end the day. No. I don't know where the other uh, four boys went, including Rotten. He just kind of disappeared. Let's go into here during the daytime. Morning, Ron. Oh, you know what? Got first? I heard there's flying. You heard right. I'll meet you downstairs in the entrance hall. I think there may have a little bit of a glitch just now, because I think Harry was sliding along in the T-pose and possibly Ron. I'll have to check the recording later. Oh, that's awesome. I, I love when uh, bad things happen, <laughs> except for, you know, game-breaking things or, you know, stuff like that. That's not cool, but in innocent stuff that is just kind of messed up is <laughs> fine. So can I go visit friend George again? Do they have anything different in the daytime? Uh oh, camera... Oh, I can go in here now. Apparently they uh, only do things at night time. Can I go under here? No. I got out the first time. That's locked. Okay, I guess they're only open at night time. That's cool. And why is it a Gryffindor-only shop? I'm sure you could get plenty of business from the other three houses. Seems like you're favoriting your own house over others. Anyway, let's go explore the castle in the daytime. That ought to be a neat thing to do next. So that's a different loading screen, technically, of the Gryffindor Tower in the daytime. And I think I will do is go open more of the desks this time around. Hi, Mr. Slytherin student. You kind of look like Dean Thomas. I can't talk to you. I can't shoot you, though. Aw, oh, sweet. I can get more beans. I'm gonna grab all the beans that I can. Nope. Okay, fine. 
You must be Ravenclaw. Unfortunately, I've got a whole term of Gilderoy Lockhart to get through. I'm sure we all do. Unfortunately, I've got a whole term of Gilderoy Lockhart. I can't Lockhart to skip get the text. I can't move, I can't skip it, I can't do anything about it. Slytherin seems not too bad right now. Do you want to swap famous witches and wizards cards? I'll give you a card number 81, Kuang Po, for a number 43, Cyprian Yaudel. I don't have that card. And that's another way to get wizard cards is that I can trade them with other people. Other students. Holy crap! You get humongous eyes. Yeah, so Ravenclaw is blue, Slytherin's green, but for some reason I don't understand why Hufflepuff is purple in this game. Normally they're yellow, and universally, like in every other game, they're yellow, but I have no idea why they're blue in this game. Something I don't understand. Well, let me explore around more of the place. Open that door. So, hold on, nothing. For some reason, I can see in here. Well, I'll worry about that later. I'm just exploring around right now. Probably do less exploration further along in the game. Hi. Oh, oh God, I'm I'm so sorry. I'm too Everyone's close to you. About the flying calf, what, a, what a laugh! That was entertaining, wasn't it? I think Gilderoy Lockhart is an absolute witch magnet. Well, that's pretty true. I think Gilderoy Lockhart is an absolute okay. witch magnet. If I talk to someone and they take forever to finish a sentence, I can't do anything about it. I just have to sit there and listen. Oh, okay. I got a classroom here this time. Let's grab all the beans. No. I'm trying to hit the other globe. Can't do anything? I have no idea what's written on there or what's being taught here. Search? Oh. Oh my god. I can search like every single desk. Oh, you now have some luminous balloons. You can equip them to B, Y, or X from their inventory and you remember all as you would a spell. To release a balloon, press the appropriate button. Use a luminous balloon as a distraction. Prefects always run to investigate. Good to know. Maybe I should put it on right now. I haven't even tried the stink pellets either. Um, you know, I'll try these first, actually. Might be a good idea. Um, what else is in the desks? A bean? Okay. I'm gonna say I'm mostly gonna find beans in here. Okay, I think I'll just open all the dust in here and I'll be right back. I got a few extra things. Not a big deal. Let's just keep exploring around though. I think would be a good idea. Hi. Are you the same one from before? I guess the ones that move around a lot. Why is this so dark? Why isn't this castle very well lit? Nope, not through there. I don't know why there's locked doors here. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. I just like grabbing all the beans that I can. I don't care what the other girls say. I think Lockhart is far too full of himself. Thank you. That is an appropriate reaction. Ha oh God, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to be that close to you. See, that's a little bit better, especially with your <laughs> low poly textures. I don't care what the other oh. girls say. I think Lockhart is far too full of himself. I did not mean to talk to you again. My bad. No way through there. Now what about this door? No? Can't get through there. I should probably say if that ought to be a good idea. I still need to launch a sting pellet. Let's just see what happens. I'll toss it in over these girls. <coughs> That's funny. They're like, ah, oh god, it's gross. <laughs> Does it affect everybody in the room? We're just within like 10 feet of it. Okay, yeah, the other guy's affected. Okay. Good to know how that works. 
I did grab a, a couple extra balloons while I was in there too. Maybe I should try one of these. See what it does. Um... Well, that was uneventful. Okay, I like the sting pellet reactions better. But good to know that I can use them to distract prefix. Sixth floor, ancient runes. Okay. The Slytherins don't want to talk to me. I think the Slytherins generally are nicer in this game than pretty much any other game. Oh, I got another classroom. Oh, oh. Here's a chest with some vines on it. Can't open it. Not sure what to do. Um, I'll search all these desks. Okay, well this is still the same room, but I also noticed there's another chest here. It looks like there's nothing on it that is preventing me from opening it. And there's another wizard card. Okay. Cool. Number 31. Balfour Blaine. Establish the, the, the Committee on Experimental Charms. Okay. Not that I really care. That's good to explore around. Open this room, here's another classroom. This is it ancient runes? Is it? Another globe to shoot at? Spearmit? I'm just grabbing all the means that I can. Oh god, what the hell is it sludge? I'll probably learn a spell to get rid of it, won't I? Shit more things. There's another chest with vines on it. I'm assuming I learned more spells to open those up. Oh, there's a giant clock up there. What what time does it say? Like, 1 o'clock? Or 12.45, actually, if that's the minute hand. Um, I'll, I'll just check all these desks, too. And there wasn't a whole lot in here, either. But let's just keep going down the floors. Hi, Slytherin. Not gonna let me talk to you? What I can do, I can launch a stink pellet at you. Ah, it smells! Well, so do you. <laughs> Slytherin. I have nothing against the Slytherins that are nice to me. I probably shouldn't keep doing that to them. Hi. I think Gilderoy Lockhart is an absolute witch magnet. Seems like it. I think Gilderoy Lockhart is an absolute witch magnet. If you're just gonna say the same thing, I don't want to talk to you. Unfortunately, I've got a whole term of Gilderoy Lockhart to get through. It does sound unfortunate. Grab all the beans. Did I- wait, did I check all the rooms that were on that other floor? I don't remember. Well, let me go check again. Those are ancient runes. Oh, there, are, there, are, there were only two rooms here. Never mind. Okay, so no magical studies. What is down here? Can't get in there. I guess if it's locked, I can't go in. Can't get in that way. Hi. Unfortunately, I don't have any lessons with Gildroy Lockhart this term. You don't have any defense against the dark arts lessons. That sounds like a bad deal. I mean, yeah, the guy's probably a joke, but you still need those lessons, don't you? Um, another... Another room full of things that I can open up. Another chest that I seemingly can't open either. I don't know. I'm gonna search all the desks again, but there's also another chest here. Looks like I can open it. And it has another wizard card. Sweet. I like collecting these. Because there's a freaking 101 of them. Number 88. Celestina Warbeck. Popular singing sorceress. Okay. Well, that was that room, I guess. Nothing super special. Oh, did I not shoot these? Pumpkin pastry apparently. I needed that. 
like collecting things. I will t gladly take all the things. It did that. Does those regenerate or what? Yeah, so some of them actually did regenerate the beans they produce, but whatever. Um, I'm just gonna keep going. Fourth floor history of magic. Okay. Hello. I collect famous witches and wizards cards. Do you? I'll give you card number 75, Mungo Bunham, for number 13, Andros the Invincible. I don't have that card. I don't have any of the cards you want. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, I'm already halfway to my to my hundred beans and I haven't even done anything productive so far in this episode. Well, except for uh Fred and George thing, but whatever. So what's in this room? If there's any more chests or anything. Are there any chests? Yeah, there's one. But won't let me open it? it looks like a spider web or something on it, okay. More green sludge. And that looks like it's all, you know, knock things out of this one and open up all the desks, desks in here too. Okay, well that's that room. Uh, what other rooms are there on this floor that I could check out? Probably no beans in that one. The whole group of people right there. Way. Nope, nothing in there. Do you collect famous witches and wizards cards? Yes, I do. Why? I'll give you card number 78, or see no thrusting, for number 98, Dymphna from Marge. I don't have that card. No, I do not. I got a group of one of each, except for me. Hey, now we have a uh, one of each house over here. That's cool. Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin all together. George Weasley told me all about your flying car escapades, Harry. Nice one. Thank you. Um, okay. That's cool. Not gonna give him anything? I already think I already talked to the other girl. Oh! Yeah, that's, that's right. Defense against the dark arts. Uh, let's open up this floor. Uh, chest? Okay. So what is this one? Dymphna Fermin. Oh! Okay, I have two of them now. Famously abducted by pixies while on vacation in Cornwall and lived in world to dread of them thereafter. Filed to- Yeah, filed. It's supposed to say failed. I don't like that. What's over here? Oh, oh it's a slide. Well, that's cool. Where the hell am I now? Uh, second floor? Uh, let me go back up to that other floor and... Or not. Nick, what's the matter? Uh, a matter of no importance. It's just that some properly decapitated Podmore won't let me join the headless hunt. Apparently they only accept huntsmen whose heads have completely parted company with their bodies. I'm sorry to hear that. Not to worry, young Potter. As I said, it's a matter of no importance. If it's not important, then why did you freaking bother my adventure? Come on, man. So anyway, uh, since I have two cards, maybe I'll be able to give one of them for a card. But I think I'm going to do that in the next episode. So thank you all for watching. And I hope to see you next time when I will hopefully be able to get another card traded. And I'm going to explore more of the castle. I'm sorry I didn't get a whole lot done in this episode, but I promise I'm going to get more stuff done next time. So hopefully I'll see you then.